Hello everyone, only the repair dude is here again. In this tutorial video, I'm going to show how to set up your own private server for A5 Factory Activision and iPad 2 Tethered Bypass. Please note for the iPad 2 Tethered Bypass, restart will reload device or in some cases it will randomly reload. As you can see here, I have an iPad 2 that I want to tether bypass with the private server. Let's get started with the tutorial video. First is to go to Google Chrome. Search for exam 5.6. Go to the exam 5.6.4 link in the search results. If you are using x64 version, download the x64 version for the 2 bit users. Use the Win32 version. For me, I'm using x64 because my Windows is x64. Open that link. Let the download start. If you get this screen, click reload. That means something wrong with the mirror. Try reloading. Allow it to download. This will take a while. Once exam is download finish, open exam installer. Click OK for this. Click next. Click next. Click next. Untick this and click next. Then click next again. Allow it to install. This will take some time. Once you finish installing exam, you can not start the control panel now. Click finish. The next step is to go to Appetex 752 website. To download the two things needed for the private server. Go download. Download Silver PHP. Followed by Leap I Mobile Device Min GW, download that as well. Open up Leap I Mobile Device, minimize the browser window, drag and drop Leap I Mobile Device folder onto the desktop, allow it to copy. This will take some time. Close the Leap iMobile device zip. Go back to the browser. Go to silverphp.zip. Okay, now close the browser window. Copy to the desktop first. Then go to this PC. Your hard disk. Exam. Toy. MEHT docs. Copy. I mean move silver PHP to the folder. After which start exam, go to X M control panel. Select English, the American flag, click save. Go to the exam control panel in the taskbar. Let it load. If it does not know, you can try opening up again. 
Press start for Apache. Once already started, minimize exam. Go to command prompt. Type CD. Drag and drop i lib i mobile device folder. Then enter i device activation activate dash t dash s local host dash silver dot php and press enter. It seems it doesn't work. I'll try again with this same command. And boom! If you get failed to activate device with record, this is normal. As long as you get bypassed or the device will activated, it is fine. I'll set up the device. I will demonstrate to you that this is standard has if I restart the device, it will relock. Or in some cases, it will randomly relock. And boom. To the springboard. I can demonstrate to you what happened if I restart the iPad. To show you this is tethered. Still on the lock screen. Turn off the iPad. Turn on the iPad again. You'll see this will be locked. And it will lock. As you can see when I start the iPad. You can redo the command to bring it back to the home screen. Unless you have an paid Apple developer account to sideload jailbreak and delete set up the app. This is a tethered bypass for the iPad 2. I really hope you enjoy my tutorial video. Please like, share and co comment on my video. Subscribe to my channel and please do donate. The link to donate is in the description below. And see you in the next video.